bringing it back old school. That's right. I got one of my first play mats uh, that I used on the channel. Really, really neat. Thought I'd include it for a cool kick butt kind of video. Uh, Patrick Long sent me old school magic packs. We're talking Onslaught, Future Sight. None of these which have been gone through, none are opened. Uh, there was a video um, where I opened some older stuff and uh, not to my knowledge, but there were a couple packs that looked like they were already gone through uh, and the top was open. I realized that near the end of the video, but these are all completely sealed, real deal. No funny business whatsoever. Rise of Eldrazi and some OG Zendikar. Nutty times, man. This is going to be a lot of fun to open. Patrick Long, thank you so much for sending this out. And also just wanted to give a quick shout out to my homie, Paul Lewis. Paul Lewis, guys, is uh, up in Fresno ICU. He's recovering from open heart surgery. So uh, send some uh, send some thoughts, some love, a uh, prayer, if that's uh, your your thing, you know, whatever the case may be. Send him some love uh, and hope for a speedy recovery. I personally, Lewis, hope you have a speedy recovery. All right. That being said, let's get into cracking capping. Oh, man, this is so cool. The old school stuff. Now, this was a time, again, Joey Moss was not present. I was not present for any of this. I did miss out because I took a, about a 10 to 15 year hiatus from Magic. But I'm back, baby. All right. Image Crafter. Shh, let's all calm down here. Let's all calm down. All right. We got Spitting Gorna. Look at that thing. Ooh, okay. That's different. Bloodline Shaman. Elf Wizard. She's painting on herself. Or she is she tattooing herself with a hentai? What do you call that stuff? I don't even know. Um, choose a creature type. Reveal the top card of your library. If that card is a creature card of the chosen type, put it in your hand. Otherwise, put it in a graveyard. That's kind of cool. A cool little card there. And then we got Catapult Squad. Followed by Threaten. Oh, he's about to brand him. He's about to make him his biscuit. Oh, no. That's not nice. Okay. What else we got? Grinning Demon. Get a load of that art, man. Oh, yeah. Grinning Demon. At the beginning of your upkeep, you lose two life. It's a 6-6 six, six with Morph on it. Morph for four. Okay. That's that's some, that's cool. I'm, no flying? You're a demon, bro. Don't all demons fly? Right? Isn't that a thing? Don't all demons fly? I thought all demons flew. I could be wrong about that. Who knew? Okay. I'm going to put the uh, the rares off in, uh, off in the cut. So no one could be like, oh, what do we got there? Okay, here we go. See, as you can see, the packs are completely sealed. There's no funny business whatsoever here. Onslaught, baby. Onslaught. Holy smokes. Holy smokes. All right. Thank you again, Patrick, for doing this. Wirewood Elf. Okay. Okay. Crown of Fury. Information Dealer. I forget we're going through all really old stuff. I want to take my time a bit here. Okay, Information Dealer. There you go. Oh, uh, Fog Beast Boy. Get up. Man, the art, it's all about the art. I can't say it enough. You'll hear me say it 10 times. Look at this art. Look at this art. But really, no, look at the art, though. Like, the art is really cool, man. Ah, uh, there you go. Steppy. Old Stipe, maybe. Sure. All right. Solar Blast. Boom. Pretty cool. Miss, Mist Form Dreamer. Ooh. You're, you're a handsome illusion wannabe angel. He's dreaming he's an angel. I think that's what's going on there. Yeah, he's dreaming he's an angel. Oh, man, the glutton is zombie. Watch out for that. Cool, cool card. With fear, it's a 3-3. Three, three. Fear is this creature can't be blocked except by artifact creatures and or black creatures. Sweet card there. Towering Bellis. Okay. With the morph, a big old 7-6 with its morph cost. All right. And, ooh, Daru Encampment. Uh, add one color to your, to your mana pool. After one target soldier gets plus one, plus one until end of turn. Uh, there's better ones out there, you know. It's okay. It's still kind of neat to see, though. All right. And we got the Reality Sculptor. Face down creatures get plus one, plus one. That's interesting for the face down creatures. That's a nice perk, but it's five. That's the, is, that, is it just me, or does that seem a little steep? It's five on that. It's pretty slick, though. Reality Sculptor. Turn target face down creature face up. Okay. It's legit, man. Pretty cool. Oh, and a foil swampy. Nice foil swamp. Dan Frazier art right there. I love and appreciate the old school foils. That is correct. That is gorgeous, man. 
they don't put the foil in here at all or down here. It's all up in that border. Really, really cool. I like the frame of it, you could say. All right, we pulled ourselves a foil. Got some action. Third onslaught pack. Woo, okay. We do got future sight to go. We, we have a lot of big stuff. I hope this brings back some memories for you guys. This is really, really cool. Uh, without a doubt. Uh-oh, no, no. What happened there? Okay, well, that has a little ding on it right there. We'll put that aside. Lay waste. Mist form mask. There you go. There you go. I'm going to put this one up here. That one's just damaged really bad. Uh, Mist form mask. Got some rangers. Look at these guys having fun just running around. They're like, is that a portal? I don't know. Okay. Uh, Merc diver. Ooh. Imagine you just like go into like the sewer or something, and then you just come across that thing. Why would you be in the sewer in the first place? You really should probably ask yourself that question first. Like, why would you, why would you be in the sewer? What's, what are you doing there? Skirk Prospector. Sacrifice a goblin. Add a red mana to your mana pool. This is going to sound silly, and you all are going to make fun of me, and that's okay, all right? But uh, I didn't realize this card was printed way back then. <laughs> I did not. We got Spy Network. And don't forget to check out the Mystery Booster Box. Okay. Yeah, go back a couple videos. Spy Network. There you go. Fun card. Gust Cloak Harrier. Okay, okay. Forgotten Cave. Legit. These packs are not cheap. You're looking at like 20 to like 35 bucks a pack that we're cracking today. So really, really cool Patrick sent these. Ascending Avon. Thrashing Mud Spawn. Ooh, that's probably like a $300 opening. That's nuts. So thank you so much. Thrashing at Mud Spawn. Okay, okay. Come on, let's get some heat, baby. Let's get some heat. Let's get some heat in the street. Fleeting Avon. Bird Wizard. What are you doing there, man? What are you doing there? You're on like a little perch there? You're like you perched up on there, little bird? Okay, yeah, little stuff. Centaur Glade. Centaur Glade. Centaur Glade. Uh, that's pretty cool, though. This one I thought was one of the more better uh, uncommons, but I think it got reprinted recently, so there you go. And Weird Harvest. What is Weird Harvest about? Each player may search his or her library for up to X creature cards. Reveal those cards and put them into his or her hand. Then each player who searches or her library this way shuffles it. That's for both people, though. That's each player. I mean, I guess that's a big downside of that. <laughs> uh, I love Future Sight. I kind of want to say Future Sight for a little bit later. Let's do some uh, Eldrazi. Let's do some Eldrazi, baby. Let's do some Eldrazi. Got to save Zendikar and Future Sight for last. It's just too cool. They are just too cool for school, baby. Too cool for school. All right. Here we go. Bloodright Invoker. All right. Let's get something dirty out of here, Eldrazi boy. Pro oh, okay. Prophetic Prism. Is that where it came from? Oh, now I know. Glory Seeker. Oh, you got to smell the pack. Oh, God. It smells like the old school magic, man. It smells like the old school magic. Crack an old pack of Magic the Gathering cards. I'm talking like 10 years or older, okay? And you're going to smell oh, the best like antiquity kind of smell you've ever had in your life. I know. It's that old school cardboard ink, whatever they did back then. It just smells like you walked into an old bookstore or something. Like, it's so cool. Uh, Enclave Cryptologist. The level up. Bada bang. Um, yeah, I think that's the first time I did level up on cards. Level up for three. Tap, draw a card. There you go. It was a zero one. Okay. Oust. Put our creature card, uh, into its owner's library second from the top. Its controller gains three life. All right. Unified will. Kind of target spell. Says controller spell. Spell's controller. Oh, sure. Okay. Unified will. Legit. Conquering Manticore. We're hoping for Eldrazi, but I think we might get a foil. Uh, conquering Manticore. Flying when Conquering Manticore enters the battlefield. Gain control of target creature and opponent controls until end of turn. And tap that creature. Gains haste until end of turn. That's cool. That's pretty cool. Kind of a crazy guy. You could have been a dragon in a past life, you know. All right. There you go. Got, we'll get that guy. Got a planes. Oh, foil, please. Please. Oh, we got something. We got something. Don't know what it is. We got something. Ooh. Okay. Nice older foil. Wild Heart Invoker. There you go. Target creature gets plus five, plus five against trample until end of turn. Bada boosh. That's when uh, they did not. See, like they started. I don't, when was the first set that they took away uh, the foil inside of there? I wonder when that was. I could not tell you. I know the first set when they dropped foil because I was playing. And that was Urza's Legacy. Um, and then Urza Saga also had some stuff. Um, but it was like promos, you know, like Judge 
kind of promos. I think, I think they gave them away at special events because they were not in booster packs. Snake Umbra. There you go. Uh, we got the Battle Rattle Shaman coming at you. Last Kiss. Do you remember your last kiss? I don't. It's been forever. I know. I know. It's so sad. I know. Hyena Umbra. There you go. Okay. Cutthroat. Ooh. Vampire Warrior. Get a load of what she's packing, huh? Look at that. Unbelievable what they put used to put on magic cards. Okay. Fun times. Fun times. Uh, hubba hubba. Alpha Guard Hound. Okay. Not Alpha. Alpha. That's, that's Mr. Alpha Hound Boy right there. Ooh, guard Gomazoil. Gomaz <laughs> I will stop pronouncing stuff right now. Just for your guys' sake. You're welcome. Okay. Cool card right there, though. Ooh, Eldrazi Conscription. <laughs> Not bad, baby. Got a huge freaking... Uh, uh, yeah. Okay. Eight drop. Tribal Enchantment. Eldrazi or They recently reprinted this, though. Enchant Creature. Enchanted Creature gets plus 10, plus 10, and has Trample and Annihilator 2, which means whenever it attacks, defending player sacrifices two permanents. That is nuts. <laughs> that thing is crazy powerful, man. Cool pool right there. That was nice. That was nice. Got a forest and the rules tips, but just the tip for Eldrazi. Okay. Now you know, guys. Now you know. Put the, uh, I'll put that up there. Wow. So one pack of uh, Rise of Eldrazi was not too shabby. Pretty cool. Oh, my. What is this? Evolving Wild. Sacrifice Evolving Wild. Search your library for a basic land card and put it on the battlefield. Tap and shuffle your library. What? That thing's busted. Did you guys read that? That is insanity. Holy freaking fetch land, man. That, that, that's got to be the first printing of this card. Unfreaking believable. Wow. And the only time they ever printed it. That is sick. Cool card right there. Holy smothering tithe. All right, we got that. Wow. Wow. I, whew. Unbelievable. I got to pause for a second because of that. All right, we got Invoker. Wow, right off the top we pulled that. That's nuts. Okay, that's nuts. Bloodthrown Vampire. Oh, man, Distraction. Yeah, tell me about it. Oh, man. Okay, we got Teacher. Man, I love the art on this stuff. Rapping Flames. Okay, that poor little bug, whatever that is. Leaf Arrow. Deal three damage, Sorry, creature with flying. Mm. Poor little birdie. Soul Surge. Okay. That's a cool uh, cool art on that one. I like that. It's pretty legit. So I'll bring it down a little bit so we can see. Drake Umbra. Okay. Totem Armor. If uh, Enchanted Creature would be destroyed, instead remove all damage from it and destroy this aura. That's pretty cool. Cool way to save stuff. Inquisition of Kozilek. Nasty. Cool card. Target player reveals his or her hand. You choose a non-land card from it with converted mana cost three or less. That player discards that card. Amazing card right there. Followed by Awakening Zone. Oh, yeah. What is this all about? Nasty little Inquisition there, though. Um, at the beginning of your upkeep, you may put a 0-1 colorless Eldrazi spawn creature token on the battlefield. It has sacrifices creature and one colorless shaman pool for three. That's kind of cool. That's not bad at all. Awakening Zone seems like a powerful card. I would not put it past this card that it's powerful. You must now know this. That sounds really good. Okay. Never played with it, though. Forest, Bada Boosh, and an Elemental Token. I wonder if these older tokens uh, bring in a penny or two. Seriously fun, guys. Seriously fun. Okay? Magic, magic wants you to know how seriously fun the game is. All right. That Evolving Wilds, though. Hot freaking dogs. All right. Uh, Zendikar. We are going up into OG Zendikar, where it's all about the fetch, baby. And there's some nasty pulls in here. OG Zendikar. That's right. That's right. Is it OG Zendikar with the fetch land? Sure. Yeah. Sure. Sure is. That's right, Billy. All right. Cell Sworder. Vines of Vastwood. Cool. Is that where that card came from? Pretty cool. Man, this is this is so nice opening this old stuff. Target creature can't be the target of spells or abilities your opponent's control this turn. If Vines of Vastwood was kicked, that creature gets plus four, plus four till end of turn. Beautiful card. Beautiful card. Oh, we got Harrow. That's not bad. Harrow's a cool card. The royal redraws the world as it passes, leaving only the hedrons unchanged. I love that. Spire Barrage. The Expedition. Look at this guy. He's happy, huh? 
He's having a good time at the landfall. That's right, he is. Bloodseeker. Mm, that is one creepy looking dude you don't want to see in an alleyway. That's all I'm saying. Or your mom with. You don't want to see your mom with this guy. All right, that's all I'm saying, guys. Goblin Bushwhacker. Fun card. The fun card. Hedron Scrabbler. <laughs> that thing looks like it would be a lot bigger. And it would be better than a 1-1 one, one weight. Whenever a land enters a bit of under your control, you plus one. It, only, it only pumps itself. Okay, for temporarily. River Boa. Great card. Island Walk. Regenerate River Boa. 2-1 for 2. Colony Gem. Add 2 mana. If anyone colored your mana pool, you got to return 2 lands to your hand, though. Kind of a downside there. Colony Gem. Okay. Green Wiver Druid. That's slick. Get to add two green mana to your mana pool. That's probably one of the better pools there uh, in the uncommon slot. I would imagine. I'm guessing. Green Wiver Druid. Cool. Love the art on that. Love the art on that. Is that me? That's me. If I lost like 75 pounds. Not bad. <laughs> oh, Magasi the Water Veil. Hot diggity dogs. Was that anything? I don't know. Okay. We're going to find out. Here we go. Enter the <laughs> Put in the Eon counter. Uh, Magasi, the Water Veil. Skip your next turn. Remove any encounter from Magasi, the Water Veil, and return it to its owner's hand. Take an extra turn after this one. I wonder if that one is uh, is worth a darn or not. Only in my wildest dream, silly. <laughs> Duh. Okay, what else we got here? Magasi, Swampy, and a Beast. Okay, so closing that one out. Cool card, though, nonetheless. Cool card, cool card. Okay, put that down here. Oh, boy. Zendikar. One more pack Zendikar in the Future Sight. I love opening Future Sight. If anyone ever gets a booster box of Future Sight and they want Joey Monster cracking on Bad Boy Gaming, you go ahead and let me do that. You will get all the shout-outs in the freaking world, pal. I'll say your name every, like, three minutes. That's right. <laughs> okay, here we go. Uh, we got Giant Boy. Oh, yeah, getting down with the clown. Uh, Vampire. Oh, yeah. Old, old school SCP, anyone? Okay. All right, Great Malenko. Great, man. Just great. Ooh, Trap Finder's Trick. Look at that. I always thought that was so creepy. Like, that art on there. Like, what are you, like, oh, who, what are you doing? You know? Vampire's Bite. Cool, cool. Man, the art. I, it, you don't see stuff like that anymore, you know? They're like, oh, no, someone's going to be offended. We can't put that on a card. Uh, Magma Rift. Relic Crush. Okay. Mmm. Angel. Angel with the wings. And we got the old trap. This was a set of traps. That's right. A lot of people got trapped in this set. Arrow Volley Trap. Living Tsunami. Oh. You gave your upkeep. Sacrifice Living Tsunami unless you return to land you control to its owner's hand. 4-4 four, four Flyer, though. I mean, I guess, you know, you keep bouncing lands and stuff. Uh, you're not really bouncing it, then you're returning it to your hand. I don't know. It's something. Akum Refuge. Okay. Uh, you gain one life and enters the battlefield. Enters tapped, though, so we all know what that means. Uh, all right, Akum Refuge. Blood Ghast. Solid pool right there. Hot dogs, baby. OG Blood Ghast. Can't block. Has haste as long as an opponent has 10 or less life. Landfall over land is a benefit of your control. You may return blood gas from your graveyard to the battlefield. Isn't that a very annoying, obnoxious card? That gets the job done. Very, very cool pool right there. I like seeing that. And then we got Forest and the Rules Tippers. Okay. Not bad at all. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba. Future Sight. Here's where it all is, baby. What we've all waited to see. At least Joy Moth has. Uh, oh, yeah. If you guys are still here with me right now, say, I want to travel back in time. That's it. <laughs> That's all I want you to say. I want to travel back in time. And I'll know you're here with me. Okay, here we go. Especially you, who never comments on my videos. You know who I'm talking about. You right there, man. You always watch my videos. You never say anything, though. I'm calling you out, pal. I want to hear from you. Right meow. Let's go. All right, Diffusion. I'm not even joking. All right, Sprout Swarm. All right, this was some old school sweet sauce, man. Sprout Swarm. There you go. Uh, Oblivion Crown. Man. Who shoved those into your skull? Ah, oh, man, buddy. Are you okay? Oh, gosh. Looks painful. Oh, that's, man. That, that's some cool art right there. Salt, I'm going to say it. Salt Skitter. That is some sweet looking art right there. I love it. Um, yep, there you go. We got the Ilkor with the shadow. Shadow was nuts. This creature can block or be blocked only by creatures with shadow. 
Yeah, when Shadow first came out, it was busted, but then they started upping the freaking uh, ante on it, making it a uh, you know higher casting cost, and you don't see it at all anymore. So there's Death Rattle. You got the Delve, destroy target non-green creature. It can't be regenerated. Death Rattle, Delve. You may remove any number of cards. Sorry, you may remove any number of cards from uh, any number of cards in your graveyard. From the game, as you play this spell, it costs one less to play for each card removed this way. Sweet mechanic there. Bl blind Phantasm. Man, that is... Come on. full. That's a full art card right there, man. That's a, uh, basically full art right there. That is legit. Future Sight just looks so cool. I like it a lot. I do. It's true, guys. It's true. I'm going to put all these future ones right here. Uh, Luma Thread Field. Creature Control. Get the plus zero, plus one with the morph on it. Grinning Ignis. Man, look at that. Come on. How sweet is that? Look at the mana symbols up here. Like Everything's just different, but then it makes us look so plain. Like They're just like, here's this big text box. That's where stuff should be, but we're just going to put nothing there. <laughs> kind of weird. Edge of Autumn. All right. Edge of Autumn. There you go. Some stuff. With Cryptic Annelid. Bada bang. Beautiful. Nice, nice bright pop to it like that cool cool pulling venom whenever enchanted land becomes tapped controller loses two life for four destroy enchanted land that's not bad i mean it's i mean it's not amazing but it's not bad you know what i'm saying it's not bad okay pulling venom you got the jailer look at that that is so neat cards and graveyards lose all abilities well they're dead so duh stupid okay no, i'm just kidding <laughs> They think it's still do stuff, guys. It's not so now. And Bitter Ordeal. Look at that art. That is some sick art by Darkin. Darkin. Search target player's library for a card or remove that card from the game. Then that player shuffles his or her library, Gravestorm. When you play this spell, copy it for each permanent put into a graveyard this turn. You may choose new targets for the copies. I don't think this one ever took off, this card right here. It's, it's pretty sweet, though. Again, more of that old school art right there. Hello. Um, yeah, I don't think this one ever took off, but really, really cool. A cool card, cool card, nonetheless. All right, last Future Sight pack. I am completely ecstatic. This was a blast to open. Um, you, what, what more do you want, man, out of a Magic uh, opening? This, this had it all. Old school, fun times, Joey Moss. It's perfect. Lanaware Empath Boy. Grave Peril. Martian, come on. Primark 4C. We got a lot of eyes there, chick. Man, I hate to date her. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> quit staring at me, weirdo. Auger. Lymph Silver. Sliver. Sorry. <laughs> Lymph Sliver. It's a Lymph Sliver. <laughs> we have fun. Blind Phantasm again. Uh, ooh, there you go. Vir virulent Sliver. We're going to stop talking. All Silver creatures have poisonous one. All Silver creatures. Have okay, that's cool. Get the infect on them. Ghost Fire. First time I ever saw that card. Bada boosh. It's colorless. Deals three damage to a creature or player. Very interesting. It's colorless. It's colorless, guys. It, it's actually colorless. Massive Ghouls. Man, this is such a cool set to look at. Massive Ghouls. 5-3 five, for 5. There you go. Big old zombie warrior, dude. Whoa. Evolution. This dude. Man, it's, it's nutty stuff. It was This whole set was like uh, just trying out a bunch of new ideas, basically. And some of these cards, uh, you know, came back around. Target creature gets plus three, plus three until end of turn. Remove evolution from the game with three time counters on it. Suspend for three. So what suspend is for three, rather than play this card from your hand, you may pay three and remove it from the game with three time counters on it. At the beginning of your upkeep, remove a time counter. When the last is removed, play it without paying its mana cost. That's how suspend works. Now you know. Snake Cult. Ooh, yeah. Snake Cult. Whoop, I want to keep these with that. Get over here. What are you doing there, rascal? back over in that little cool area. Uh, Enchanted Creature has Poisonous 3. There you go. Whenever it deals combat damage to a player, that player gets 3 poison counters. A player with 10 or more poison counters loses the game. They call it Infect now, guys. They call it Infect. Embalm. I'm sorry. Emblem of the War Mind. Creatures you control have haste for 2. Enchant Creature you control. Oh, I got Enchanted Creature. If only creatures had haste for only 2, that would be busted. If it was just a normal enchantment, not an aura. Wow. Yeah. And Imperial Mask to close this one out. I think I just pulled that card the other day. Wow. What a freaking crazy cool just running back through time this has been. 
um, I had a, a really, I had a hoot. If you guys enjoyed the video, by all means, take a moment, hit that like button, that evolving wilds though. Oh man. Um, just un un I, I, what more do you want out of an opening? <laughs> uh, thanks guys for tuning in. Enjoy Moss and Bad Boy Gaming. Get out of here. Skip yourself. Up for teenage crime.